Hi guys, welcome to Thoughtful Thursdays with me, Meeta Nanda. So today's story is that of a priest um who um was a priest in a temple in a village. Um and um once there was a flood uh, that happened in the village and uh, just before the water had start to collect um, a man came running um, to the priest and he told him or informed him about the flood and he said that you come along and you need to leave the temple right away but uh, the priest said uh, you go uh, i have been serving god for so many years and uh, god will take care of me you go you don't bother so the man goes after a while the water starts to collect inside the temple and uh, the priest keeps on praying uh, for help um, and finally has to climb onto the pedestal uh, because the water was rising then uh, a man uh, came on the boat to rescue the priest uh, he said you come along uh, there is no way to get out if i leave there wouldn't be anyone to come to rescue you he says no god uh, will come and help me i have served god for so many years he is definitely going to help me okay so the man left the water kept rising and rising and finally the priest had to climb on top of the temple and very very disheartened and you know but he still kept praying that i know god will definitely come to help me but uh, what happens is uh, that a helicopter a man in the helicopter comes to rescue him and you know throws the ladder below and he says please climb onto this there is no way anyone else is going to come to rescue you you're the only person left in the village but again the priest says no god will come to rescue me you go so the helicopter leaves and he prays and he prays and he prays and he finally starts to curse god and he starts to fight with god that i've prayed i've 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 served you for so many years and you're not coming to help me so the god uh, then finally gets very wild he 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 comes in front of him and he says a usually priest i came to rescue you three times the man who came running the the person who came on the boat and the person who came uh, in the helicopter all three were me but you fail to recognize me you fail to recognize my voice you fail to recognize my help now come on let's go so finally the priest does get saved but if you notice uh in life when when we pray and uh, um you know when we pray do we really believe we, we really hope that uh, our, our prayers will be answered and are they answered do we look for the answers or we just pray and get disheartened uh, when we don't get things and we crip we pray and we crip we pray and we crip but it's important to look for answers there and then and god does answer god divinity universe whatever you believe in you always get answers now universe tends to send our answers uh, or help in the form of people 90 to 95% of the time it's people maybe it's family it's colleague it's your friend uh, it, it's not necessary that it will be someone unknown uh, it could be anyone but are we ready and open for answers of uh, do we do we really look for them so what i tend to do is um i i whenever i have a question i have my doubts i uh, ask the universe uh, just before sleeping so i imagine the universe to be like a genie you know a genie looking down at me tell me your wish is my command so i i tend to uh, imagine a genie uh, as if i'm talking to the genie and i and ask my question is this the right thing for me or you know show me the way or whatever it is and i believe that i will get my answers and i do the next day within the next 24 to 48 hours i always get my answers if i can get them so can you now it can be in the form of people 
or it can be in the form of subtle signs which is the next 5% so 95% of the times it's people through which god will answer your prayers and it's 5% of the times that it will you know send you hints um uh, for guidance so um many a times we tend to miss opportunities in life because we were not open minded we did not pay attention to them uh many times when you do miss the opportunity as humans uh god sends those opportunities again and if something that you see has repeatedly been coming in front of you has been repeatedly been told to you pay attention maybe it's maybe it's god's voice maybe it's the universe telling you something listen so in my next video i will be talking about those uh, 5% signs um that god or universe sends uh with with live examples of my life from my life so um yeah so stay tuned uh and the rest we all know that life is beautiful it will always remain what you make of it think about it see ya